Greetings and salutations, denizens of the internet. My name is Chad Griffiths, and today we're going to be playing some Realm of the Mad God. You may have seen uh, me and Milcom's most recent video we posted, which was a playthrough. Uh, well, well, it was more Milcom dying horribly to an in uh, to the Forbidden Jungle, which has killed many a noobish character. Thing is, Milcom isn't a noob. He's gotten to level 20 before another character, so he has no excuse. Anyway, I'm getting off topic. Here I have a necromancer and a ninja. This necromancer is essentially my pot farmer. So, to make things a little bit easier for me and Milcom in our uh, in our main series of dungeons, I'm going to use this guy to get some interesting items and pots. The issue is, as you may have noticed, the black border of death. I don't have the best computer in the world, so this is gonna be a little bit laggy, so, uh, bear with me. Thing is, this guy, not great for sprite worlds, not great for snake pits, not great for basically any dungeon. He is not a dungeon killer, but what he does, and what he does, he does well. This guy, he murders gods. So it's time to kill some gods. First up on the menu, let's find out. It appears to be... who will be the first god to be killed on camera. Eh, constructs. Those things are good for health. Leviathan, the most difficult god. In my opinion, at least. If, uh, as you know, I'm the one who studies the games, and, uh, I was studying Realm of the Mad God from several sources. Silver Dollar, uh, Talwar, the ROTMG wiki. But, uh, Talwar made a... a thing that... in how he ranks the gods and levels of difficulty, and he ranked Leviathan at the highest. Frankly, I completely agree with him. The thing is a beast, and that shotgun has killed many, many a robe class over his years. So, a uh, little bit about me. I am decently experienced at this game. I played it... I started playing it before pets were even introduced. And, uh, if you want to hear a rant about pets, this is not the, uh, this is not the place for a rant about pets. I personally thought they added to the game, but that's just because I hate dying with characters, and even with pets I still die, but that's probably because my pet is not maxed. I mean, he's rare, but he's not maxed. The heal's nice, though. Um, so we're just gonna hunt down some gods, and I'm gonna basically podcast about this game with momentary pauses of panic, because god, Medusas are scary when there's, like, two, three of them, four of them. I once uh, teleported directly into Godlands, everyone's had this moment, and uh, saw six frost demons, that's this guy in white who I'm shooting here, uh, seven medusas, and uh, <laughs> two djinns, and I teleported right on top of them, and that's how I lost my necro, because the djinn was uh, going into its damaging state, where it shoots out just a giant barrage of death, so, you know, that was, that was some terrible luck. Eh, mad lab here. How is my lag in Mad Lab? Hmm. I mean, let's go for it. You only live once. Well, with this character, you only live once at least. In this game, I mean. So I was thinking, and it occurred to me that um, the best way for me to do these solos, to tide you guys over, these these I can make fast. Uh, me and Milcom getting together and recording is difficult because uh, our schedules differ quite a bit and uh, we have some like family dynamics and stuff going on. But this is just some stuff to uh, tide you guys over whenever you feel like it. And I'm not just planning on playing this. Uh, this is like my equivalent of Milcom's daily vlogs because frankly, it's probably easier for me to make, more fun for me to make a video than to make a daily vlog. So this will be every other daily playthrough. I mean, not even a playthrough, just look in at a game. As you can see, the lag is so bad. Ooh, boss. You see this? You see this nonsense right now? I, I clicked teleport. What the? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, boy. Whoever decided that there should be lag in the Flash version, aka my terrible internet service, should be burned at the stake, because that that was pretty scary. Because teleporting right on top of, uh, what's his name? What's his face? Mad Scientist. Actually, his name's probably in chat. Who Killmaster? Uh, 
He didn't say at least my final creation is safe, which is weird because he usually does. Um, ooh, tarot card. Dang it. Okay. So possibly no loot from this. We might be able to get some from the second boss. He's just one guy, so he usually doesn't cause too much lag. Uh, the Mad Lab is one of those dungeons I can do. Snake Pit, Sprite Worlds, oh boy no. Limon is a nightmare. And uh, I was doing an epic spider den earlier today, and it was like, uh, and I made it to the boss. We were doing this perfect clear. It was going perfectly. I mean, somebody had activated it beforehand, but um, it wasn't a big deal. And then suddenly, <clears throat> it would have been all fine, except that boss just shoots out her little uh, her little spray of bullets, and boom, I I force I force quit the game, cause cause that's fun. That's that's enjoyable to force quit a spider den after you just beat your way through all of the horribly, horribly annoying minions. It's not not a fun time. But, so that's why mostly I play on my Steam, which is what I'm playing on with Milkum. That's where my wizard is. But uh, Milkum and me have promised to only do our playthroughs with each other. So I can't play on that right now, but I was, I was craving some realm fix and content is content. So, you know, when, when you see this, it's content. One, one thing that me and Malcolm have discussed is that one of the keys to having a good YouTube channel is to post regular, regular content, because regular content is what gets the views, and the views are what get the, uh, the good stuff, like, well, recognition, more subscribers, uh, which would allow us to, like, see that this is a real investment. Um, I have some better recording software ready, uh, right now I'm using not the highest stuff, but um, it's gonna get better. I'm also the one who creates all the graphics for it. Do we want to go for for our videos? Do you wanna? Do we want to go fight the avatar? Uh, why not? No. Oh. We'll see what state he's at. Uh, I figured out a way for. Oh no, he's he's far too late. We're not gonna get any loot from this. I mean, maybe we can pick up a drop that someone doesn't want. I mean, people drop. I've seen people drop T11 stuff in, after fighting an avatar. Crazy sons guns. I mean, it's because they've ma they're max and they've got all the wine cellar tops and they're rich. And I'm like, why can't that be me? It will be though someday. Milk and me first have to complete our a uh, little dungeon challenge, which is which I'm enjoying. I am. Did you, did you see that lag spike? I could I could already be dead. Okay, I'm not dead. Maybe someone will drop something interesting. Yeah. Okay, no shatters, no no interesting drops. Yes! I had a rule to myself. Every time What the what was that? Was that banishment? I'll have to look back on the recording and see what we just missed. <laughs> too busy, too busy celebrating, but still, what? Uh, I excuse you? Why? No, that that wasn't a speed sprout. That that was a robe. That was a robe of the shadow magus, and I was like, yeah, robe of the shadow magus. But now it's not. Oh, oh okay. Except not okay. Sure, sure. Why not? Why not? Why not? I mean. Why not? Just my luck, really. But other stuff to talk about. Um, wow, this is going to be the least productive. I want at least one pop before I quit this recording because, and the and it's not going to be more than fifteen minutes because I've learned that people don't want to watch this sort of thing for too long, even if it is in podcast style. Um, but you know, it's all it's all about the fun of it. This making videos is fun. Uh, me and Welcome enjoy doing it. That's why we're doing it. We haven't even monetized our channel. The only reason I'm even considering monetizing our channel, and uh, some of our YouTuber friends of ours recommended it to us, is because if you give YouTube some moolah, then they give you some views. So I took a look for our channel on my personal account that I use to watch videos. I had a difficult time finding it. That's because since we haven't bought into the whole YouTube monetization thing, we're not letting people show ads for our videos yet, um, it's making it difficult to get many views. So right now we only have 28 subscribers, and except for like two people, I think, 
those are all friends of ours who we uh, recruited when we first started this up. So we're not really getting any growing subscribers. So the plan is essentially to post regular content and to try to get out there somehow. Because I know that there are ways for a YouTube channel to, um, to get started up. But I'm still working on exactly how, and I'm sure if we continue doing this, which is a definite possibility, uh, even if we go to college, we're planning, we're making plans for that. When we continue doing this, we're gonna look back on this video years later, and we're gonna be like, you know, this is, this is where we started. And I, I wonder how far we will have come. We're now, we're just derping around on, uh, screencast-o-matic, you know. <laughs> Uh, messing around low leveling games, but we're going to improve. We're going to get better, and the quality of our videos is going to improve drastically. The sound quality, oh my god, the sound quality has just gotten, ooh, pair attack. Uh, the sound quality has just gotten so much better than it used to be because I got a mic for Christmas, and I don't know if you guys have noticed. You'll notice because we'll be posting a new Five Nights at Freddy's video, but um, we the sound quality's improved. And I'd like to apologize for not posting content as often as I do. Um, this is a bit easier than a whole vlog with Milcom and me because he needs to get to my house, we need to record it, I need to get to his house, it's difficult. Um, but I'm super busy. Uh, I'm trying to get my Eagle Scout and uh, I'm in a local competition in the region where I live and uh, fingers crossed for the winning of that one. But it's, it's moving along, and we're going to try to post more regularly. And these will be coming out to tide you over, along with Milcom's daily, every other daily vlogs. And in the end, it's going to end up for a good experience for everyone. So I'm not going to find a pot, because <laughs> apparently no pot for me, but I got para attack, so some form of loot was gained. I feel satisfied. So... This has been Shad Griffiths. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.